Inverted or invert sugar syrup is a mixture of glucose and fructose. It is obtained by splitting sucrose into these two components. Compared with its precursor, sucrose, inverted sugar is sweetener and its products tend to retain moisture and are less prone to crystallization. Inverted sugar is therefore valued by bakers, who refer to the syrup as trimolin or invert syrup. In technical terms, sucrose is a disaccharide, which means that it is a molecule derived from two simple sugars. In the case of sucrose, these monosaccharide building blocks are fructose and glucose. The splitting of sucrose is a hydrolysis reaction. The hydrolysis can be induced simply by heating an aqueous solution of sucrose, but more commonly, catalysts are added to accelerate the conversion. The biological catalysts that are added are called sucrases and invertases. Sucrases and invertases are types of glycoside hydrolase enzymes. Acid, such as lemon juice or cream of tartar, can also accelerate the conversion of sucrose to invert. Chemical reaction of the inversion, the term inverted is derived from the method of measuring the concentration of sugar syrup using a polarimeter. Plain polarized light, when passed through a sample of pure sucrose solution, is rotated to the right. As the solution is converted to a mixture of sucrose, fructose and glucose, the amount of rotation is reduced until the direction of rotation has changed from right to left. C12 H22011 plus H20 C6 H1206 plus C6 H1206, net, plus 66.5 a degree converts to a 39 a degree. Hydrolysis is a chemical reaction in which a molecule breaks down by the addition of water. Hydrolysis of sucrose yields glucose and fructose about 85%. The reaction temperature can be maintained at 50 a euro 60 a a degree Celsius. Inverting sugar. Inverted sugar syrup can be easily made by adding water and roughly 1 gram of citric acid or ascorbic acid per kilogram of sugar. Cream of tartar or fresh lemon juice may also be used. The mixture is boiled for 20 minutes to get to a temperature of 114 AA degrees Celsius, and will convert enough of the sucrose to effectively prevent crystallization, without giving a noticeably sour taste. Invert sugar syrup may also be produced without the use of acids or enzymes by thermal means alone. Two parts granulated sucrose and one part water simmered for five to seven minutes will convert a modest portion to invert sugar. All inverted sugar syrups are created from hydrolyzing sucrose to glucose and fructose by heating a sucrose solution, then relying on time alone, with the catalytic properties of an acid or enzymes used to speed the reaction. Commercially prepared enzyme catalyzed solutions are inverted at 60 AA degrees Celsius. The optimum pH for inversion is 5.0. Invertase is added at a rate of about 0.15% of the syrup's weight, and inversion time will be about 8 hours. When completed, the syrup temperature is raised to inactivate the invertase, but the syrup is concentrated in a vacuum evaporator to preserve color. Commercially prepared hydrochloric acid catalyzed solutions may be inverted at the relatively low temperature of 50 AA degrees Celsius. The optimum pH for acid catalyzed inversion is 2.15. As the inversion temperature is increased, the inversion time decreases. They are neutralized when the desired level of inversion is reached. In confectionery and candy making, cream of tartar is commonly used as the acidulant with typical amounts in the range of 0.15 to 0.25% of the sugar's weight. The use of cream of tartar imparts a honey-like flavor to the syrup. After the inversion is completed, it may be neutralized with baking soda using a weight of 45% of the cream of tartar's weight. When adding baking soda and whipping or mixing, the hot syrup will foam and bubble up, so some care is required. A much taller pan than otherwise needed will contain the foam. Make sure there is enough water remaining in the syrup to dissolve the baking soda. Alternatively, dissolve the baking soda in a little extra water, and ensure the syrup's temperature is somewhat below 100 AA degrees Celsius. The amount of water can be increased to increase the time it takes to reach the desired final temperature, and increasing the time increases the amount of inversion that occurs. In general, Higher final temperatures result in thicker syrups, and lower final temperatures, in thinner ones.
all constituent sugars support fermentation, so invert sugar solutions may be fermented as readily as sucrose solutions. Shelf life, invert sugar has a lower water activity than that of sucrose, so it provides more powerful preserving qualities to products that use it. The shelf life of partial inverts is approximately six months, depending on storage and climatic conditions. Crystallized invert sugar solutions may be restored to their liquid state by gently heating. Notable uses, honey is a mixture of glucose and fructose, giving it similar properties to invert syrup. This gives it the ability to remain liquid for long periods of time. Jam, when made, produces invert sugar during extensive heating under the action of the acid in the fruit. Golden syrup is a syrup of approximately 56% invert syrup, 44% sucrose. Fondant filling for chocolates is unique in that the conversion enzyme is added, but not activated before the filling is enrobed with chocolate. The very viscous filling then becomes less viscous with time, giving the creamy consistency desired. Cigarettes use inverted sugar as a casing to add flavor. Alcoholic beverage manufacturers often add invert sugar in the production of drinks like gin, scotch whiskey, beer and sparkling wines for flavoring. Candy sugar is a type of invert sugar used in the brewing of Belgian-style beers to boost alcohol content without drastically increasing the body of the beer. It is frequently found in the styles of beer known as double and triple. See also, high fructose corn syrup, external links, carbohydrates. Carbohydrates. Retrieved May 1, 2006. A, making simple syrup is an exercise in chemical reactions. A word from Carol Krosky. Archived from the original on July 14, 2007. Retrieved May 1, 2006. A, Invert sugar in distillery. Invert sugar syrup. Retrieved October 20, 2011. Uh, Invertars. Retrieved November 27, 2012. Uh, notes. References.